starts now. Good evening, everyone. I'm Chad Mira. And I'm Lauren Culber. Thanks for watching tonight. In our top story, six months from now, the first passengers will be using Williston's new airport. The new Williston Basin International Airport, or XWA, is scheduled to open October 10th. Jim Olson was there this week to show us how the facility is taking shape. It's looking like a real airport terminal these days. We're walking into the departures vestibule, which will be where passengers get dropped off. From the front door to the wide open ticketing space, to the escalator and elevator, to the baggage carousel area, to rental car facilities, wide open TSA checkpoint area, restaurant and more. Airport director Anthony Dudas can't wait for the first customers to arrive. And really the accommodations that we have that you should expect when you're flying out of a modern facility. But with just six months until the scheduled opening, this massive site will be a beehive of activity. We have about 150 people every day in this facility alone right now. So it's, it's getting really busy. A lot of work is getting done. We have over 20 prime contractors working on any given project on this 1600 acre site as we commence uh, full summer construction here over the next two weeks or so. And while there's much work to complete, Dudas can already point to a lot of progress. The building is about 98% enclosed. There's fit and finish work going on. He points out the spot where a children's play area is coming, where a mother's nursing room will be located, and the long stretch of windows that look out on the oil-rich farmland that surrounds the terminal. We'll have lounge-type seating available for the passengers so that they can relax, have their food from the restaurant. Right now, the windows reveal the beginnings of taxiways and runways, while all around, workers tackle job after job and city officials keep close watch. We have to continue to make sure we're monitoring their progress and, and moving forward to make sure we can meet those critical dates and milestones. It's all with one goal in sight, getting the new XWA off the ground in six months. It is really just a great front door to our community. In Williston, Jim Olson, KX News. The new airport is much larger than the current one, and it's being built to handle future growth in passenger numbers. Manager Anthony Duda says that growth is something he and City Council member Chris Brastoon have been working on in recent months. Duda says the hope is to attract another airline to serve Williston. Like uh, an Allegiant or a Sun Country that do weekly trips to Las Vegas and Phoenix and potentially Florida. And then there's additional potential on other air carriers, and we're continuing to have those conversations. The manager says he's optimistic the talks could lead to more options for travelers in Williston, but there are no signed contracts.